to another YouTube video from Trail Engineering. This one is a cold weather spec aviation bowser used for ground handling for replenishment of drinking water on commercial airlines. This one's got a lot of equipment on it so I'm just going to show you a few features. So it's running on a 2800 kg chassis. It's a 1125 litre tank of approved drinking water. That's about 250 gallons. And it's got an electric start, a Yamaha a diesel engine, carrying a grass approved water pump. So we're going around. So in there, that's your electric start key start in a lockable box. As I say, that's going to start a Yamaha diesel engine which has got a smoke filter on it. Again, a lot of this is all airport spec. Moving around, got a battery in there that's going to power your engine and there's also a split level charger in there so while you're towing the vehicle it'll be charging the battery. Now all the pipe work on this has all been lagged and it also has trace wire heating. So when we move to the back of the job we'll be able to show you where you switch your trace wire heating on. How that works is that when the temperature drops as long as you've got the thing plugged in to the mains, uh, as the temperature drops, the heating system will automatically kick in and then it'll put all the full range of pipes sort of from freezing and then it's got lagging on top of there as well. So one of the coldest places in the country is an airport in the winter, so all this is protected against the cold. So let me carry on moving around. So we've got a beacon switch there that switches your airport beacon on. Ladder rack for your ladders so you can access underneath the aircraft. And here we have a stainless steel tube that you fill with chlorinated water. Aircraft adapter so you can add to the aircraft. Breakaway coupling as well so somebody drives away while that's going to the aircraft and break. And then when you finish with it to keep the air nice and clear, you then submerge it back into your chlorinated water. There's a drain off our base, draining it off. It's a daily replacement with clean water. We've got a, a self-attracting hose reel, a brewer's hose for drinking water. And then there is an immersion heater in the tank. As I say, this is cold weather spec. So there's an immersion heater in the tank to be switched on when the tank is full. Got a flow meter there that gives you the flow rate and also the quantity that you're dispensing. So I'm going to the electrics. So this is a thermostat that works the trace wire heating. So as the temperature drops, there's a sensor in there and it'll then switch the heating on, which you'll need to connect to a 110 volt power supply. So connect that to 110 volt power supply. Battery charger that then also charges the battery. So if you plug that in overnight, the battery will be charged up. As I said, the tank must be full before turning on the heating system. So to turn that on, so you've got the battery charge out already on, the mains on, and then you've got your heating. So you switch that on when your tank is full of water. Side, there's an advertisement board so you can put your logo on there that's obviously optional and then you've got step so you can access the tank easily and then we have also added a suck back to tank feature as well so basically I'm going to demonstrate we're going to pump the water out of the tank and then all we need to do is to switch the two valves and that will do the opposite it'll suck the water back into the tank emptying all the water that's in your hose reel and emptying the water in your pipes as well again to stop freezing so let's fire it up and show you it working so i'm going to dispense out the tank turn the lever there and it's just going to be a case of turning the switch So the volume of pumping is about 40 
seven litres a minute. Okay, so we've dispensed out the tank. So, as I said before, when you want to suck back the tank, to suck the water out of the pipes, so going back into the tank, you just simply turn the one lever there, turn the other lever there, fire it up, and it'll do the reverse. That's about it for the walk around of Trench Viewings, cold weather aviation water bather. Don't forget to check out our website, trangeviewing.co.uk, and our other videos on YouTube. Thanks for watching.